Welcome to our second episode in our series of Market Snapshots. I'm George Hadgelis, and uh, we'd like to just take a quick moment of your time. So what happened in our marketplace over the last four weeks? What we can say quite comfortably is that we, as an agency, held our nerve in the marketplace where there is plenty of pessimism and we achieved some outstanding results. So April itself was consistent with other Aprils gone by. Our clearance rate for our auctions was 60% and that included our on-site and in-room auctions. So all in all, well above the Brisbane average of 30%. Today, of course, the Real Estate Institute of Queensland produced some rental figures. They suggest that the inner city market in Brisbane has tightened where vacancy rates are now just over 2%. Our vacancy rates sit a little bit higher than that, but the good news for us is we've been able to fill some properties that have been empty for some time and we've been able to fill them with very good qualified tenants. So we look forward to an easier transition towards the end of the year when the tenancies traditionally change over. Regarding the uh, election, well today our, you, our voters, you have a real choice to make. This election has a clearly defined two horse race that will be influenced by outsiders somewhere along the line. For you, you have an important decision. You make a decision today that will be to the benefit of you and your family over the next three years. And we wish you well with that. I'm sure a lot of thought has gone into it. Also today, we got uh, the Reserve Bank held the cash rate steady at where it has been over the last little period of time. That should give confidence to the marketplace and I think overall we'll see some excellent results as we trek towards the end of the financial year. I wish you well at the uh, polling booths on Saturday the 18th of May. Make your vote count. I'm George Hadgelis. Thanks for listening.